Hey guys, so I got two books here titled Oops and Shh, authored by Susie Klein. I used to borrow these from the library, but then I then I um, ordered, <clears throat> sorry, then I ordered these from like eBay slash Amazon. So I thought I'd show you guys in, in case any of you remember these. I'll start, actually I'll start with the Shh book because that came out first. Look, it's a little girl and her dog saying shh. When I ordered this one, I wasn't sure if this was the this was the right one, but here it is. Yep. All right. Shh. Susie Klein, pictures by Dora Letter, Albert Whitman, and Company Niles, Illinois. For Jennifer and Emily, who don't like being shhed, SK to Kirsten DL. All right. Shh, says my mother. The baby is sleeping. Shh, says grandma. Your grandpa is napping. Shh, says my father. I'm writing at my desk. says my brother, I'm watching television. Shh, says my sister, I'm studying for a test. <laughs> Obviously. Shh, says my auntie, I'm counting all my stitches. Shh, says my uncle, I'm playing a game of chess. Says the teacher, the children are working. Shh, says the librarian, people are reading. Yeah, gotta be quiet at the libraries. If it wasn't for the library, I wouldn't have heard of these books. Shh, says my grandpa, a fish is nibbling on my line. Shh, says my sister, don't talk in church. Says my mother, I'm talking on the phone. Shh, says my father, I'm talking to your mother. So I tiptoe outside to my backyard. No one is there but me and I, well, yell and scream and whistle and jump. I haven't jumped in years and I can't even whistle. Yodel and holler and, what is it? Ah yes, shout and thump. Well, she ain't no thumper, but she, but she's definitely, you know, you get the idea. Bellow and roar, bark and whoop. Screech and cheer. Squawk and swoop. <laughs> Shriek and squeak. And cry out loud. Yippee yay, hey hey. Yippee yay, hee hee. It's a raw raw day for me, me, me. After I do that, I don't mind if I have to be quiet again. So, shh. <laughs> That's the shh book. And now it's time for the oops book. Oops. Look at the little girl messing up <laughs> cereals that hasn't even been bought yet. <laughs> Susie Klein pictures from Dora later. Yep. Just like the shh book. Four years later, oops. Oops. <laughs> oh, she's tripping over the cat. For my Emmy Sue, SK, for my nephew, what? This could stop being blurry. What? DL. All right, here we go. 
Oops, I dropped my soap. Uh-oh, the towel fell in. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oops, I spilled my juice. Help, it spilled on Dad. Uh-oh, guessing he wasn't very happy. <laughs> Oops, my coat slid off. Uh-oh, it knocked down Joe's. <laughs> Oops, I tripped on the cat. Oh boy. Now, how did I do that? <laughs> Maybe because the cat came out of nowhere. <laughs> Mom says be careful. <laughs> Maybe not too careful. <laughs> Dad says slow down. <laughs> Even I can barely go slow like that. <laughs> But I am not the only one who does an oops around. <laughs> Kids are playing. The cat spills food. <laughs> oops, mom dropped the phone. Uh-oh, it was her boss. <laughs> oh, she's so fired. <laughs> Maybe not. But <sighs> oops. Dad ripped the bag. Look out, there go the eggs. Oh, that doesn't do any good. Oops, the teacher dribbled paint. Oh no, on the principal. Oh dear. <laughs> Whoops. Oops, mom slipped on ice. Uh oh, she did it twice. <laughs> good rhyme. Oops, Dad dropped his glasses. Oh boy, there goes the lens. Oh dear. It seems to me it's not just me that does an oops. Occasionally. See, most of the time I do just fine. Alrighty. I used to love reading these books. <laughs> All right.